god. Look at this video. Hold on, let me put my glasses on. Okay. Can you not zoom in on this thing? No, just watch it. It's funny. Who is this? I don't know who he is. He's just a famous guy on social media. So you just follow a bunch of people that you don't even know? I mean, yeah. I don't even know every celebrity that I follow. You better be careful with that. Next thing you know, they're going to have your information and show up to my front door. Oh, great heavens! Never mind. Just give me that back. It's not even funny anymore. Hey, son. How was school? Great. Look what I got on my math test. Holy f 90 out of 100? Good job! Thanks, Dad! What? Let me see. Hmm. Son, did you add a zero to this? Uh, no. Son, I'm gonna ask you again. Did you add a zero yourself? No, Mommy, I didn't add the zero. Okay, since you're lying, I'm grounding you from your phone and game. But, Mom, I swear I didn't add the zero. Okay, I'll give you one more chance. Tell me the truth. I didn't add the zero. Are you kidding me? I added the nine. Oh, my God. Okay, class, so the goal today is whoever gets the most signatures from kids about committing to not do drugs wins and doesn't have to do homework for a whole week. Excuse me, Ms. Johnson? I like to win, so how am I going to get these kids to sign? You can use any tools you think are necessary to convince kids that drugs are bad later that day. Okay, our top two finalists are Rachel and Mark. Rachel, you got 15 signatures. How did you do it? I just told them this is your brain before drugs and this is your brain after drugs. Wow, great job. Okay, Mark, and you got 369. How? I used the same diagram. I said this is your hole before prison and this is your hole after prison. I win. Oh, <laughs> It was urgent. Well, you do that on your own time. 
Actually, I can't. She went to surgery. Then you'll see her when she comes out. I'm not giving you my phone. Excuse me? Did you pay for it? What does that have to do with anything? You say it's your phone, but someone else pays the bills, like your mom or dad. Well, my mom can take my phone if she wants. Oh, wait, she can't because she went to surgery. Would you like to go to the principal's office? I'd love to. Give me your phone first. Are you kidding me? I won't let you disrupt my class. Me disrupt your class? You could have finished your lesson by now. I'm not going to ask you again. It's my phone. And it's my class. Did you pay for it? Don't forget to put your seatbelt on. I have it on already. Be careful, okay? Okay, here we go. There's no car on the road. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, great heavens! Hey, son. Mommy, you're home. Is Dan not home yet? Yes, he brought a random girl over saying he was going to help her with something. Say what? Hey! Hi, Papa! <gasps> oh, my God! Yeah. I'm done. Hey, yeah, let me hear you try to get out of this. Well, I drove past this homeless girl, and I thought she needed help. So I brought her here and gave her some stuff that you don't use anymore. Are you serious? That's still not a good excuse. I'm not done. So when she was finally leaving, she stopped and asked, Is there anything else your wife doesn't use anymore? <laughs> Emotional damage. Mark, your sister has three kids and she just turned 20? Yeah. Wow, it must be something in the air. Yeah, her legs. Miss Jordan, what are the hurts more um i think getting kicked in the nuts hurts more oh and why is that well because moms get burned and then later they think that isn't so bad let's do it again now, i've never heard anybody that gets kicked in the nuts and later thinking that wasn't so bad kick me in the nuts again oh great heavens dad i bet you a hundred dollars i can drink this glass of water without touching the towel without touching the towel yeah without touching it Wait, let me see. Okay, that's gonna be the easiest $100 ever. Okay, watch. Oh, Um, my dad's dead. Oh, well, come with me. I'll give you a free dad. Oh, okay. In the car. Where's my free dad? Hello? Hey, I kidnapped your son. What? I'm kidnapped? Send me one million dollars. Put the phone on speaker. I want to talk to him. Uh, okay. Mark, do you know where my phone is at? What? Man, you're talking through your phone. Oh, you're right. Thank you. So are you going to send me the one million dollars? Well, since he failed his exams, I don't need him anymore. Because I need a smart son that will become a lawyer or a doctor to make me rich. You failed your exams? Uh, <laughs> yeah, so the deal's off. I'm going to go make another son tonight. Bye. Okay, never mind. You're free to go. Why? Because I only kidnap future lawyers and doctors. Oh, great heavens! Dad said we're getting whoopings when he comes home. Really? Yeah, but I have a plan. You got a plan? I'm gonna act like I like it. What? That's not gonna work. I guess we'll see. Hey, you ready for this whooping boy? I'm ready. Then get your over here. Go ahead. Hey, Mom, can I? No. But what if I... No. Mommy, hear me out. No. Ugh. Three, two, one. Mom. No. Fine. A couple hours later. Hey, why didn't you clean the house like I asked you to? Mommy, I literally tried to ask you to wash the dishes, and you said no. Huh? Then I tried to ask you if I could clean my room, and you said no. What? And then I was trying to be nice and ask to sweep up the floors, and you said no. Really? And now I'll try to ask you, can I? Stop. Yes, you can. Okay, great. I'm going out with my friends. I'll be back at midnight. Oh, great heavens! Oh, great heavens!
Son, who is she? It's Susie, the neighbor's daughter. Oh, I was hoping you wouldn't say that. Why? Son, you must promise not to tell your mom. But Susie is actually your sister. What? 
one week later. Hey, Dad. What's up? I fell in love again, and she's even hotter. Nice. What's her name? Angela. She's my teacher's daughter. Crap. I wish you didn't say that. Angela is also your sister. Oh, are you serious? This went on a few more times. <laughs> Mommy, I'm so mad. Why, honey? Because I fell in love with six girls, but I can't date any of them because dad is their father. Oh, sweetie, you can date whoever you want because he isn't your real dad. <laughs> hey, son, how was your test today? Not too bad, actually. I got some love. Um, that's bad, son. Oh, okay, well, bad. Pretty bad. So you failed your test? Yep, and then Miss Parker wanted to say she want to have a one-on-one -on -one with me. Okay, well, that means she wants to... Fight me. What? She wants to fight me. No, she wants to sit down and go over the lesson one-on-one. -on -one. Oops. Oops, what? I pushed her old ass down the stairs. You did what now? And she never got up. Oh, her lungs. Hey, son, how was school? All right. What's wrong? School is getting too much work, and I have depression. Give me your phone. Why? Because you're always on the phone. Oh, Hey, buddy, I'm home. Hey, sweetie, how are you? Good. Yeah. How was school? Did they teach you a good day? Yeah. Hey, do you know anything about this game we talked about in history class? Sure. What is it, sweetie? It's, um, the year 2020. Red means stop, green means go. What does yellow mean again? Slow down. Okay. What does yellow mean? Slow down. Boyfriend again. Hello again, Mrs. Adams. Welcome back to this crazy family. And I don't even want to tell you, but there's my annoying dumb brother. What's up, bro? What's up? I really think you should stop calling him dumb. No, I'll prove it to you that he's dumb. Hey, brother, what has four letters, sometimes has nine, and never has five? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I told you. Hey, sis, I bet you $100 I can turn your hand over without touching it. Ha, that's going to be the easiest $100 I've ever made because that's impossible. Let's do it. Okay, stick out your hand. Okay. No, the other way. Oops. Where's my $100? <laughs> dare you to say something else. Ugh, I hate you. Oh, you hate me, huh? What? I didn't mean to say that. It's not true. So you wouldn't have said it if it wasn't true. You hate me. Okay, all right. The next day. Hey, Mommy, can you grab the cereal from the top of the refrigerator? No. Why? You hate me, remember? Oh, my heavens. Mom, can you check my homework to see if it's right? Still no. You hate me, remember? Ugh. Hey, Mommy. What? What are we going to have for dinner? Food. But I'm not giving you any because you hate me. Oh, my heavens. Yo, what's up, son? I mean that. Hey, Uncle Fred. Thanks for picking me up. You sound kind of sad. What's wrong? There's this girl in my class that I like, but I don't know what to say to her. I got you. Tell her this. Will that really work? I mean, it made you. What? Nothing, nothing. Just use it. The next day. Hey, sorry to bother you, but you're beautiful. Aw, thank you. But I have a boyfriend. Is he an organ donor? No. He's not? No, why? Because you're way too beautiful to be with someone who can't give you their heart. <laughs> Hey, brother. What's up, Fred? Last night was one of the best nights ever. Oh, yeah? You must have been fired. Actually, it was a heat, not a cheat. Oh, okay. You do you, bro. Who knows? I might get lucky tonight again. <laughs> You're crazy, bro. A few minutes later. Hey, Dad. What's up, son? Why do you seem so happy? Don't tell Mom, but I lost my guitar last night. What? Really? 
Yeah. Well, sit down. Let's talk about it. I can't. It hurts to sit right now. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Oh, great heavens! <laughs> Call my woman. Sure, which one? You have a few contacts saved as my woman. Hey, you? Nah, you know my phone be acting up sometimes. Sir, please stop the cat. You created these contacts yourself. No, I didn't. On God, you absolutely did. Oh, really? I think you should look at his text messages from last Friday around 2 p.m. Siri, shut up. As a matter of fact, I just sent you a screenshot. Thank you, Siri. You're welcome. Oh, great heavens! Hey, babe, can you call my phone? Yeah, sure. Hey, Siri, call my woman. Sure, which one? You have a few contacts saved as my woman. Hey, you? Nah, you know my phone be acting up sometimes. Sir, please stop the cap. You created these contacts yourself. No, I didn't. On God, you absolutely did. Oh, really? I think you should look at his text messages from last Friday around 2 p.m. Siri, shut up! As a matter of fact, I just sent you a screenshot. Thank you, Siri. You're welcome. Oh, great heavens! Babe, yeah? Babe, yeah, what's up? I was trying to tell you that your phone was ringing, but whoever called left a voicemail. Yeah, it was probably one of the guys. You know, I'm running late, so... Siri, can you play my last voicemail, please? Sir, are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Wouldn't you like to come listen to it yourself? No, I would like for you to play my last voicemail. Okay, it's your funeral. But looks like I'll be going to your funeral instead. Oh, great heavens! Thanks, baby, for the fun day. It was fun, huh? It was. All right, you ready to go home? Yeah, let's go make a baby. All right, Siri, take us home. Sure, I see two locations. Would you like directions to your first home or second home? A second home? Siri, what is you on right now? Man, come on. Please, I'm on that same PS you be on when your girl is not around. You know what? I'll take us home ourselves. We're good. I don't need you. You know what, Siri? Yeah, take us to the second home. Girl, I got you. Starting directions to Jennifer's house at 1028. Yo ass is caught now. Oh, great heavens! Dad, can I get a toy? Yeah, you take the toy and you put it in the pants because it becomes invisible and free. Really? Yeah, let's go. Okay. Back at home. Here's your toy, son. Thanks, Dad. Oh, why is your white liquid on it? Oh, don't worry about it. It's just juice. Oh, great heavens! Mommy, can I get a toy? Of course, sweetie. You don't have to ask. Yay! Oh, and you can take more than one toy. Really? You're way better than Dad. I know I am. Hey, what's up, son? What's going on, Dad? Nothing much. Your mom just told me you got your first paycheck. I did. How does it feel? I mean, it feels great. It feels good to be able to buy anything that I want without asking you guys. Oh, yeah. I remember my first check. I felt the same way. Yeah, I feel like it's like the first step to me becoming an adult. It feels really cool. That's definitely the first step. And, oh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and give you this. And you can pay the bill whenever you want, but it's actually due on the first. Uh, what's this? Uh, that's your phone bill. 
my phone bill, I have to pay this? Um, yeah, that's part of it. Once you work, you start buying things you want, but you also gotta pay some bills. That's how life works. Oh, we good? Everything cool? Yeah. Remember, it's due on the first. Have a good day. Oh, great heavens! Hey, Miss Johnson, I have a riddle for you. Oh, I'm really good with riddles. Let's hear it. How do you put an elephant in the fridge? What? You can't fit an elephant in the fridge. You open the door, you put the elephant in, and then you close it. How do you put a giraffe in the fridge? Easy. You open the door, you put the giraffe in, and then you close it. No. You open the door, you take the elephant out, you put the giraffe in, and then you close it. Huh? The Lion King is having a birthday party, and all the animals are there except for one. Which one? Let me guess. The lion king. No, the giraffe. Because he's still in the fridge. Ah, this is hurting my brain. Okay, and a girl named Lisa wants to get across a huge river with a lot of alligators. So she gets across safely. How? She stuck on the alligator's mouth. No, all the animals are at the lion's birthday party, including the alligators. Oh, great heavens! One week later. Hey, why are you late this time? My mom's in the hospital. What? Still? It's been a week. Is she okay? Yeah, she's a doctor. Oh, hey, man, you want to get soap to wash you? Um, yeah, that would be nice. Hey, soap, get in here. He wants you to wash him. Thanks, man. Wait a minute. Hi, I'm soap. <laughs> What's your problem? I'm too smart for the first grade. My sister is in grade three, and I'm smarter than her, too. Okay, let's go see what the principal has to say. Okay. Okay, I'll give him a test, but if he fails even one question, he has to go back to class and be quiet. Ask him, what's two times two? Four. What's six times six? Thirty-six. I don't see a reason why he shouldn't go to third grade. He answered my questions correctly. Okay, let me ask him some questions. Sure. What does a cow have four of that I only have two of? Legs. What do you have in your pants that I don't have? Um, pockets. What does a dog do that a man steps into? Pants. What starts with an F and ends with a K? Fire truck. Put him in fifth grade because I got the last four questions wrong myself. Oh, great heavens! Yeah, don't worry. I'm going to talk to him. So your mom told me you got in trouble today for fighting in school. Yeah. All that money we spent, you know you should not be fighting. Yeah. Oh boy, that's what I'm talking about. You did what I showed you, right? So tell me what happened. He put his hands on me. Hey, he put his hands on you? You should have knocked him out. Don't let nobody touch you, okay? Okay. So I need you to sit here and to think about what you did. You're going to be on punishment for a whole week. You know good damn well you shouldn't be doing that. You did it. You did it, bro. I got you. Yeah, he's in his room crying. He'll be alright. Hey, son. What's up? I have some really bad news. What is it, Dad? I have a very rare disease, and I might not make it. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I thought you said it was bad news. Oh, okay. Well, good night. Good night, Dad. Where am I? Hi, son. I brought you with me. You brought me with you? Oh, great heavens! What's up? I have some really bad news. What is it, Dad? I have a very rare disease. And I might not make it. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I thought you said it was bad news. Oh, okay. Well, good night. Good night, Dad. Where am I? Hi, son. I brought you with me. You brought me with you? Oh, 